Missouri Governor Parson is taking sweeping executive action on unregulated strains of cannabis. Joe McLean breaks down today's new order and the products that will soon be banned from Missouri's shelves. These are the two products a child would see if they went into a store. And you can compare them side by side to see what they are. One is the normal product. The other is infused with THC, the type derived from hemp, not cannabis. Still, their effect can be very similar to weed. That's why Parson said this type of advertising practice is dangerous, particularly for young children. This is where the center of our issue lies, concerns for the safety of Missouri children. These packages are not clearly labeled, Parsons' executive order means starting September 1st, the sale of any intoxicating THC will be banned unless it's from a state-approved source. And right now, there's no process for the state to approve a source, meaning until further notice, selling these products is effectively banned altogether. Public safety is about protecting people from harm and reducing hazards, particularly when it comes to innocent children and vulnerable populations. But many retailers say the state taking such a sweeping action hurts other vulnerable populations. John Grady works with his wife marketing their hemp-infused drinks not to kids, but to veterans and those with challenging medical issues. We are not trying to sell these dangerous products to children. In fact, we've been coming to the Capitol since 2022 asking legislators to work with us on legislation. In fact, the Missouri Hemp Trade Association has long pleaded for age restrictions, product testing requirements, and other regulations, which most most of them claim to impose anyway. The executive order only affects the sale of these products, meaning it won't impact consumers who have or use them. In Jefferson City, Joe McLean, KY3 News.